Hello, my name is Anastasia, and I'm a PhD student in ML Labs based in TU Dublin. My PhD focus is on sound generation, and more specifically, on high-level control of timbre synthesis. Why? First of all, because sound is fun. And secondly, because it can be applied in so many fields. It is useful not only to sound producers for music synthesis, voice conversion, or even audio compression, but also to every single person when they use text-to-speech applications or even some uh, voice enhancements. Well, Tombre represents the quality of sound. It is the difference in hearing when you play a single note on different instruments or even when different people try to express the same vowel. In order to achieve natural synthesized timbre, you need to ask three main questions. First of all, how can I digitally represent sound? How can I go back from this representation to the original waveform? And which type of generative model can I use? Let's start with a simple example. Let's assume that we have this incredible sound here. that produces this waveform on the left, which is so rich that we cannot extract any information out of it. Therefore, we can use some simple signal processing techniques to create some other sorts of representations that would have more meaning to us. So we can uh, generate a power spectrogram, male frequency spectrogram, chromogram, or many others. Going from this uh, waveform to some sort of representation, it's easy. However, going back, it's not that simple. Usually, they need some uh, computationally expensive signal processing techniques, and we end up with just an approximation of the original sound. After we create these representations, we can feed them into a neural network, along with the pitch, text, or even emotion, depending on the type of application that we want to create. When the network is trained, we can generate new representations uh, that, have, uh, that have specific properties and then find a way to go back to the original waveform using some signal processing techniques or even um, another neural network. So the whole process is fun, right? Thank you for watching.